customers to do interviews in a crowded, crowded markets. Crowded markets are great, yeah, which means a lot more people have having that problem. So all you need to do is measure seven users in a representative sample. Let's say uh, I'll use Zappos. So Zappos was one company I did user research for. Uh, you know, Zappos is a shoe shopping website in the U.S. When I looked at their, you know, even take any competitor of theirs, uh, you know, who's selling shoes online or even shoes offline. I looked at, when you see that, you, I saw that 70% of people who did shoe shopping were women. Only 30% were men. So I went and talked to 10 users, seven of them women and 10 or three of them men. In that seven women, uh, it skewed a little younger. Uh, people who are, you know, out, outgoing, extroverted, they tend to shop more. So of the seven users, four people were more extroverted and younger, three people were more introverted or older. So this is how I went and talked and used instead of, and this is the one biggest mistake that I made in my early days. I went and asked them about the product and the solution first. Hey, do you like this product? Will you use this product? If so, how will you use this product? If you use this product, will you recommend this to your friends? Ask them about, hey, you know, it's great that you're coming to shopping today. Hey, what were your, what, what did you do in the past? How did you go about shopping in the past? What did you like or dislike about it? How are you doing it today? In the future, what would you like to see improve?